today will be all about catching up with the tasks because I had a day off yesterday. It's kind of a birthday day off. So my birthday was on 7th of August Sunday and it was already the weekend so I decided to take off the next day. And what I did was I've been following Catherine Manning for so long. She has this brand strategy blueprint. I printed out, did this thing. I don't even know what to call. It's like a really nice workbook now. So yeah, I basically like written down all of the things related to the brand, personal brand mostly. So, and then, yeah, I thought a lot about what I'm doing, what I'm doing wrong, what's my current strategy and the, like the feature that I'm planning and my plans, goals, projects, etc., etc. all of that jazz. Apparently my current strategy is no strategy. <laughs> I wasn't even posting consistently. I wasn't creating content for so long. I'm not consistent on Instagram as well. So yeah, the plan is to change that. That's why after yesterday, after thinking about my goals and stuff, I just started vlogging again. I have some goals and then projects to achieve those goals. I'm planning to publish a video every week on YouTube at least one video and then daily posts on Instagram. I have a full-time job. It will be hard for me to like do all of these things and be consistent. It's hard to focus on stuff after your shift ends. You want to go out, you want to see your friends. To provide that, I will plan my days according to what I want to achieve instead of just playing with the ear. I might need help to edit these videos because it takes forever for me to edit. My sister might help on that area. I'm not sure how it will go because she also needs to learn it. She really wants to learn how to edit videos and stuff. It could be a nice summer project for her as well while she's on her summer break. So other than that, I started my work day. It's around 1.30 p.m. right now. I have a meeting in half an hour with Sanjana. You know her from the other vlog, the offsite vlog, if you watched go watch if you didn't and in the evening we'll go to the theater so it's Madonna in a fur coat from Sabahattin Ali it's an emotional roller coaster book adaptation so you might read the book if you want I guess it's translated in English as well yeah just read it if you want to cry I have to get ready super quick. Am I ready or what? Yes, I'm ready. I hate makeup, so I guess I'll do it only on my wedding day. So we left on, while they are on play break. Because the tickets are wasn't cheap actually like not really expensive but not really cheap as well but one person played four different roles what the heck and something happened somebody shouted very disrespectfully while he is leaving and said that you are conning people there are a lot of people here you butchered the book and Eren was so hungry we were like we just better go and eat something instead of watching this and it was so full of breaks they cut the scenes to like move furnitures and stuff for 500 times and it was so annoying it wasn't really flowing at all so so yeah we are now gonna go and eat something are ended. I'm just gonna go and lie 
on bed right now. Hey again. So I lay down a bit. I still feel that I need to take a break or rest at least. I feel like I have so much to do. I have a lot of things that I scheduled for tonight, but I, I have to go to bed early. I worked a bit more and I'm so sleepy now. I guess I'll just crash somewhere. Good morning. I am so effing sleepy and I need to take a shower. But before that, I had a meeting. So I managed to join and I have a meeting in half an hour. And after that, I have nothing. No meetings nothing i'll just sleep for a few hours and then come back and then work because i've been working until uh very late lately so i might just work a few hours today instead of like trying to complete the eight hours fun stuff in the evening i have a meeting with my sister we are basically just uh talk a bit about if she can spend her summer break while learning to edit videos. She just wanted to learn and help me. I don't like to support slavery, so of course I'll pay her, but can be an intern salary. Procrastination, this is what I do. This is the make time. show you something sometimes when I have too many meetings I feel like I haven't get anything done I feel the constant anxiety that I should be working more than I'm working at that moment so I don't trust my brain <laughs> and I don't trust my thought and judgment on myself so that's why I came up with this idea of tracking the time when I'm in a meeting or when I'm working on a small task or when I'm working on one quick little thing that should supposed to take uh, five minutes but sometimes it takes an hour half an hour while you're working on those things and not the stuff that you should be working on you feel like you haven't really done anything because they are still there they are still on your to-do list so that's why sometimes I'm using this clockify tool I'll show you Sorry, my front camera is not the best, but still, I don't think it's important. Okay, so this is the tool. What you can do is basically, I don't do this every day. You can see that I sometimes do it when I feel overwhelmed with the work and when I wake up with work anxiety or when there's tasks that I need to tackle or like when there's a big feature coming next. I do this time to time, but I remember there was some time that I did like constantly and it was really productive for me so I'll show can I say this year oh yeah you see I was really into this tool around May and you can see and especially when you have projects like this you can add projects you see that what's taking most of your time so back then around me we were hiring a marketing designer of course it took some time and i was also working on marketing design things assets and stuff so they were taking a lot of my time apparently and i'm working both like on design system and feature work thingies actually feature work is my main priority but you can see here i actually work the most on marketing design design system and then feature design you can also see that how much time you're spending on meetings if this is too much more than you should be working on your tasks you can bring this up uh, and talk to your manager so you can be more productive I'm gonna go time tracker I'm mostly using the Chrome extension and the calendar view so in calendar view you can uh, basically integrate your calendar like this this is the view that I'm using the most so what I do basically did I work on this 
this morning no I didn't maybe I should just delete that I basically copied this one here because I was in a meeting with Nalia so I can say design system so what I did here was I'll create slot I don't want to give details of the feature yet because it's uh, it will be released after some time so I'll just write down feature work and say feature work here and here what I'm doing is time tracking organization I can say this admin because it's more related to organizing myself so the difference with this one I don't like time blocking because whenever I block my time in the calendar I feel like let's say I put here feature work or let's say I say design system task hear me out whenever I do this I cannot really do anything between this and this time frame because I feel that I know that at three o'clock I need to work on this like design system task so it's not productive for me because I feel anxiety all the time so instead what I do is I'll delete this I just start the timer whenever I'm working on things or whenever I forgot to add something here so I add it afterwards when I'm finished with that thing so let's say I'll work on more feature work instead of time looking I usually just go to time tracker and then like type the name of the thing that I will start working so let's say uh, feature work again when this is on I don't spend time on Twitter I don't spend time on scrolling through Instagram okay let's stop this let me know if you're interested I love productivity stuff I'm a nerd I'm an undisciplined productivity nerd so I can make a separate video for this or related to tools books apps all the stuff that I'm using related to productivity that's all with the Clockify this is not sponsored or anything but if you like to do that I mean I'd love it we are going out using this but I designed this one if you want to download I'll put the link in the description <laughs>